Hi guys, today I am going to be doing the no mirror makeup challenge. So um, basically what that is is just doing your makeup with no mirror. <laughs> I was tagged by Courtney Pollock. I will link her video and her channel below so that you can go subscribe. So I'm going to go in with my Ready Set Gorgeous Foundation in the shade 210. This. I feel like if I like, like I want to stare in one place, but I feel like if I stare in one place, people will think that's a mirror. How's this color for me, guys? I haven't used this since forever. Since, like, it came out. I'm going to use this on my eyes, too. I hope I'm in focus. Oh, my God. we do <laughs> okay so that was a foundation um and now i'm going to conceal and i'm going to be using the estee lauder double wear concealer in light and i'm just going to put that under my eyes under my eyes oh and i'm going to pat that out with my fingers I don't even know how this is going. I'm confident in my foundation routine though because it's like second nature to me. Um, but everything else I'm kind of scared about, especially mascara. <laughs> So I hope that's blended out. I'm going to take my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in the shade Light and a tapered blending brush. And I'm just going to set that now before that creases. You can do it over the lid too. Seems a little powdery. Okay. And then I'm going to take my mineralized skin finish in medium plus. I'm not looking in the mirror. Totally didn't even think about that. Never use these little mirrors anyway. They're just not the best. See, like the face is so easy for me, I think. I mean, I don't know how I'm doing, but I feel like I'm doing well. I'm to take my City Color Contour Effects Palette, and I'm just going to take the bronze color on this brush and bronze. Oh, God. I'm scared. I think I used too much. I didn't tap it off. I forgot. So we'll blend this extra then. Well, obviously on the sides of our nose. I feel like I need more over here to even it out. Am I right? 
All right, and while we're here, I'm going to take the same tapered um, brush and the highlight color and just highlight with that. Let me make sure I'm still recording. All right. All right, I am. Okay, and now we're going to move on to blush. I'm going to be using the blush quad, which is a little broken. Um, I'm going to take... Let's have fun. Let's go with that one. On a blush brush. These are really things that did. I mess up with these when I have a mirror, so... Is that bad? How is it? <laughs> I'm afraid. I'm trying to be very light handed with this, but I know how pigmented these blushes are. I don't know why I chose these. Okay, I'm thinking of doing a very sultry eye today, and I'm not going to be looking, is there a mirror there? Yeah, there is. I'm not going to be looking at the mirror. Um, so I'm just going to start with the shade T's, and apply that into my crease. It's really easy if you look down, you can kind of feel where your eyeball is. So that's like where the crease is, for me at least. <laughs> Okay, now I'm going to go in with the shade Busted and do that same thing. I'm focusing this more on the outer corner though. Watch this come out like my best makeup tutorial ever. No. <laughs> Imagine. I can actually fall asleep when I'm not like really paying attention. I just... <laughs> so we're gonna go like really neutral on the eyes and then do like a pop on the lips then. Okay, I'm going to take the shade Suspect with my finger and apply that to my lid. I should put the brush down. And then blend that out. And then I'm going to go in with blackout. Oh yeah. And just define the outer V. Define the outer V. Okay. Blend, blend, blend. Okay, and now, like usual, I'm going to take a pencil brush and take the shade T's and do that under my eye.
And then to brighten up the inner eye corner, I'm going to take the color Booty Call on that same brush and brighten it up. How's that look? And then just in case we got any fallout, I don't know if I did, but I'm going to try to flick it away. How is it? <laughs> the Maybelline one with the Maybelline brush. And let's do a classic winged liner. <laughs> and how's that I feel good I feel good about this I really do I think we're doing well oh oh this one's better Are they even? Alright. Alright, how does that look? Okay, now we're going to apply mascara. I hate doing mascara without a mirror. I feel like I have to concentrate so hard. I'm awful at mascara to begin with, though. Make sure I'm still recording. All right, still recording. Ah, oh, I got it on my nose. I was going strong. I was doing really good, I think. Then I got it on my nose. All right, let's let that dry. <laughs> okay, well, the nose dry, so I can flick it off. Let's go on to lips. So I'm going to take the Bossy Lip Liner um, and Lippy Stick from ColourPop. And let's lip line my Let's lip line. Let's line my lips. I don't think I did good. Alright. Mm. I don't know how I did with that. Alright, and the lippy stick and bossy. Now I just gotta wipe this off. Where is it? Is that it? Anastasia and a little angled brush. And let's do this. Ooh, this is where I'm gonna mess up. I don't feel like this is good. Thought I did good. Alright. 
that's the first brow let's move right on to the second one i'm so sorry that i forgot that guys This eyebrow is better. I already feel it. Now time for the big reveal. So I'm going to actually take my mirror from this side. And wow. Okay. So my skin looks perfect. It looks... Oh, I missed a little up there. <laughs> but other than that, my skin looks perfect. Um, the brows are awful. I knew that they were going to be... I mean, I have to really, really focus for my brows. The blush is way more blended than I expected that it was going to be. Like, my skin looks good. Like, I would really walk out of the house with my skin like this. Not, no joke. The lips are a little Kylie Jenner. <laughs> is literally couldn't have been any perfect. Couldn't have been, like... I don't like it's a little messed up here this wing is totally F, like what um my eyeshadow is perfect so my eyeshadow and my face are perfect I don't know if you could tell um the mascara is pretty good I mean obviously I got it a little over here and a little there it's pretty good I am proud of myself like like go me I did it really well I think that was a lot of fun and I wanted to thank Courtney for tagging me that's awesome and I had so much fun doing this. So I'm going to tag everyone who watches this video. If you haven't done it yet, then do it. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And again, thank you, Courtney. I will have all her information below um, as far as her video goes and her channel. And thank you so much for tagging me. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.